A lot of people like to keep tequila and other alcohol in their freezer. It is so common, in fact, that you watching this right now probably have a bottle in your freezer. But the question is, why would someone put tequila or any alcohol in their freezer in the first place? As the temperature of a spirit drops, the viscosity or thickness of that spirit increases. That means, for example, a vodka that's been hanging out in the freezer for a little while has a much better texture, it becomes more palatable, and it kind of coats the mouth as you're drinking it. And the colder that a spirit becomes, it's usually a little bit easier to drink in and of itself, especially something a little bit harsher like a vodka, because then it tends not to burn as much. And while that kind of sounds great, can it actually be a bad thing? What the big trade-off is, is that as the temperature of a spirit drops, so does the aroma and the flavors. And while that's not really a problem with vodka because it doesn't really taste like anything and it's not supposed to taste like anything, tequila isn't like that. There's beautiful aromas and flavors that are naturally there that become muted if you put it in the freezer and it reaches a certain temperature. All right, I'm really happy I committed to this whole filming in the freezers thing, but I'm a little worried I'm gonna get lost in my walk-in freezer. <laughs> But I can already hear you guys in the comments. Well, I like to keep my Casamigos in the freezer because it makes it so much easier to drink. And yeah, you're right. If you do buy low quality tequila and you shove it in the freezer, it's going to make it easier to drink. And that's because not every tequila is created equally. And while all different producers have different methods and they use different water sources and different things, there are a lot of producers who like to use additives to cut corners and that ends up actually leading to an inferior product and it leads to a product that doesn't have that the best flavor and it has this like, almost fake vanilla or cotton candy kind of flavor and so yeah you if you put your casamigos in the freezer it's going to taste better because it didn't taste good to begin with but when you get a tequila that is truly well made and it's done in the right way it is something that is absolutely beautiful to behold tequila is an incredibly complex spirit that is full of amazing aromas and flavors and it is a spirit that is intended to be sipped at room temperature that is the best way to get all of the flavors that the master distiller originally intended when they created this incredible spirit tequila comes from the agave plant which takes anywhere between six to twelve years to reach full maturity before they can cut it up out of the ground and turn it into this delightful Spirit. All of that time spent in the ground, it's acquired these amazing flavors from the terroir, the water source, all of these different incredible elements that make up an amazing spirit. And if you freeze it, you're just losing all of that. And it's actually a similar case to putting it on the rocks. You're going to uh, mute the flavors and the aromas. And sure, it's going to chill it, but you're not going to be able to get that amazing flavor. This isn't like a whiskey. It doesn't really need water to open up. But the best part, in my opinion, of a really well-made tequila is the rich, robust agave forward flavor. After all, it's made from that plant that took so long to grow. Why wouldn't you want to taste that? But all of that does mean that if you want a really high quality, quick drink, it's super easy. You just come over here, you pick up a bottle off of your shelf, you grab yourself a glass and you pour some out. And while I love tequila cocktails. I think tequila cocktails are some of the most complex and amazing, but sometimes you don't want to make a cocktail. Sometimes you just want to grab something, pour a little bit of it, and sit and enjoy that. You know what I mean? And so when you want a good drink, but you don't really want to sit there and make a cocktail, I think tequila is the perfect sipper at room temperature. You don't have to do anything. Just grab it and you pour it. And so, yeah, I can understand why you would put your crappy, low quality, gross tequila in the freezer. It's going to make it easier to drink. But what I don't understand is when people go out and spend a bunch of money on a really sought after, high quality brand of tequila, and then just to shove it in their freezer. My question is, why are you buying that tequila? Do you know why the tequila is even good? Why are you spending your money on a higher end, more expensive tequila, and then just to shove it in the freezer so that it tastes like every other spirit out there? And so, no, I don't think you should put your better, higher quality tequila in a freezer. If you can't handle that full, robust flavor, then maybe don't spend your money on a spirit that tastes like that or drink something different. But really good tequila, in my opinion, should not be put in your freezer. But if you're still buying Casamigos, then I don't really know what to tell you and I don't know how you stumbled upon my channel. But I have this great other video that you can watch right over here next. So you can stop buying this and drinking this crap.